Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Keegan here and I'm back with another video for you guys. And today's video I'm bringing you guys is a quick DVD update for Monday, October 3rd, 2022. So for today's update, I got one DVD to show. And this DVD I ordered off eBay and I got it in the mail on Monday. So I got this DVD about a week ago. And I've actually been meaning to do this update over the last couple days, but I just haven't really gotten around to doing it until now. So yeah, I don't really have a whole lot to say, so this is going to be a pretty quick video. So uh, without further ado, let's get started with this quick update. And the DVD I have here, it doesn't say what year this DVD was released, but I'm guessing this DVD was released in 1999, I believe, but I could be wrong though. And that is Happiness, which this is a 1998 film. And it's a Todd Solondis or Solondis or Solondis, however you say his last name. It's a Todd Solondis film. And it's from the director of Welcome to the Dollhouse, which is a movie I have not checked out, but I do want to check it out. And this is a movie I've been on the hunt for for a very long time. And now I finally have it. And I will definitely check out this movie soon. Deeply disturbing and shockingly funny, one of the most, one of the few undeniable movies of the year is David Anson of Newsweek. Mature audiences only, viewer discretion is advised. Anyways, here's the front. And here's the spine. And here's the back. Savagely, subtly, savagely, evilly funny, says Janet Maslin of the New York Times. And this movie stars Jane Addams, Elizabeth Ashley, Dylan Baker, Laura Flynn Boyle, Bangazera, Jared Harris, the late Philip Seymour Hoffman, Louise Lasser, John Lovitz, Cameron Manheim, Rufus Reed, and Cynthia Stevenson. And there are no special features on this DVD whatsoever. Although, since this is a Canadian DVD, it was released by Seville. However, when I checked the opening, it was actually a Trimark DVD from 1999. Although this is a Canadian print, it was actually, it's a pressing from Trimark Home Video. And this is a Killer Films movie, co produced with Good Machine. And in the United States, this movie is rated R, and it's not rated. And... I believe this movie was originally rated NC-17, but I'm not sure though. And this actually has the wrong running time. It says 111 minutes, but the run time is actually 139 minutes. I don't know how they could screw that up, but it's 139 minutes. Anyways, here's the, here's the disc. And I haven't watched this movie yet, but this is a movie I've been looking for for the longest time, and now I finally have it. And I hear great things about this movie, but I hear it's a really dark movie, specifically because one of the characters in this movie is a pedophile. And that's what kind of what makes this movie most notorious for the one of the main characters is a pedo. But I will check this movie out. I hear it's disturbing, great, and funny. So I will definitely check this movie out sometime soon. And I do believe there is a sequel called Life After Wartime, which I will probably get one day. So anyways, that's happiness. And uh, that's going to be it for this update. And before I end this video, I want to let you guys know I got another video coming out later on today. So stay tuned for another video. But anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment below, and subscribe for more videos like this. And as always, feel free to follow me on my Instagram, Letterboxd, and Serialize. The links are in the description, as always. But anyways, until next time, this is Keegan Shepard signing off. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, and uh, have a great day, everyone. Peace out.